Are we rolling? Yes, we're rolling. Okay. Sorry. Is this okay? Um. Ask your questions. It's good. For I'm sure. an open gnome. So tell me a little bit about yourself. My name is Periwinkle Nomington. I'm a gnome, obviously. Uh, I live in St. Louis, Missouri, and I go to Webster University. And I'm actually the first gnome in my family to leave home and go to school. Usually we're homeschooled. Do you tell a lot of people that you're a gnome? God. I'm really going to ask that. Um, I don't use, I don't know. People normally see gnomes, and they're in people's front yards, standing still, not doing anything. And then you see me up walking around. So it's probably not hard to tell that I'm not a gnome. That didn't make sense what I said. But it, it's, it's not hard to tell that I'm a gnome because of my hat, but I move around a lot. And I don't feel the need to tell everybody all the time. So. No! I'm a gnome! I go to Webster. I'm an audio major here. Uh, I dabble in music. I write. I sing. I produce. I, and I didn't know you could go to school for this stuff. It's really cool that I can come here and learn about audio. Audio gnome. That's what I call it. That's, that's going to be the name of my production company whenever I... Audio gnome. What about the fact that you're a gnome? AUD. Did you know that you would be the first gnome to ever attend Webster? I didn't really think about it like that. Um, I'm glad to be here. I'm glad I'm a gnome. And I mean, that's I, I couldn't stay in that yard my whole entire life. You know, I had to get out. They they usually think I'm just like a weird kid with a weird hat on, and a lot of people don't associate me being a gnome. So I get kind of judged for it, like I'm just like some weirdo. But it, I don't know. I don't mind it. I don't let it bother me. So you're really a gnome? I'm really a gnome. My dad is a garden gnome also. And he gardens a lot. That's why I came here. I'd like to be a recording engineer. Uh, maybe even a producer. Yeah. Yeah, a producer would be really cool if I could produce my own records and things like that. What kind of music do you like? I like pop, I like rock, I like jazz, I like hip hop, I like funk. I mostly like a lot of human music. I don't, I'm not really into gnome music. I'm not that hot on it. <laughs> How do you feel about your son leaving the yard and going off to college? When he first told me, you know, I reacted like I'm sure most parents react when uh, your son tells you they want to give up the family business to chase a dream. Uh, as Nomikins, we've been in the law and armament business for, oh, about, oh, well, let me see, about... Yeah, I mean, that's, that's what... That's, I mean, A hundred, two hundred years, you know. Uh, Perry and me, we come from a long line of long ornament gnomes. My father, his father before him, and his father before him, all the way back to Perry Winkle the first. How have you been adjusting to your new surroundings? Um, so far so good. I got a really good room. I like my bed. I really like the food here at Webster. Okay. It's so different from what I normally eat back home. What do gnomes normally eat? You don't want to know. I'm just going to go to class. You guys can come if you want. It's looking good. Whoa. Go home, gnome. Well, frankly, uh, it's been difficult for Nomington. Uh, I noticed that my students don't want him in their work groups, but frankly, I think it's because they don't understand him. I think he's a good kid. He studies hard. I certainly have no complaints. I've talked to him a couple of times. He's nice, you know. And would you hang out with him? Yeah, I would hang out with him. He seems pretty cool. He played some music in class once, and I really liked it. The gnome? Pfft, yeah, I've seen him. 
little hat. What a freak. I don't get people, man. I don't understand who could be such a jerk. Jeez. You know what? Forget it. I don't care. Screw it. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna get my associates. All right, I'm gonna be a huge record producer. I'm gonna have Chingy, I'm gonna have Nelly, okay? I'm gonna have Smelly, I'm gonna have Clingy. It's gonna be freaking awesome. They don't fuck this place, I don't care. I'm better than them. So what all does being a lawn gnome entail? Well, it's a dangerous job, you know, and thankless. I mean, think about it. When was the last time you heard a human say Thank you for keeping the robbers from our home garden, Gnome. <laughs> Never. Here I sit all cute and cuddly, watching over the human's lawn all day, keeping the dog away from the petunias, and I don't even get washed off when I get all muddy. That's why I'm glad Perry's going to college, so he don't have to sit in the lawn all day long with no thanks but he's making something of himself. He's inspired me to try to get a job too, you know. I'm going out there in the workforce too. Yep, my boy is making something of himself. 